Fun Fridays number four. When they first announced a live action Minecraft movie, I was genuinely really, really confused on how they were gonna pull that off. Because when you think of Minecraft, you don't think of live action, right? Those two things just don't go together. Video game adaptations recently have been extremely hit or miss. I mean, on one hand, you have things like The Last of Us, Fallout, and even though I personally didn't like it very much, the Super Mario Brothers movie was a huge success. But then you also have movies like Borderlands, which I did unfortunately see in the movie theaters this year, and I genuinely thought that there could never be a worse video game to movie adaptation than Borderlands. And if you haven't seen it, it fucking stinks. It smells like roadkill. It was ugly. It was uninspired. It really had almost nothing to do with the video game itself. So I genuinely thought it couldn't get any worse. But then our good friends over at Warner Brothers proved me the fuck wrong. And they released what seems to be, in my opinion, one of the worst movie trailers that's ever been released in the history of time ever. If you haven't seen the trailer yet and you simply don't believe me that it's that bad, just stick around to the end of the video and I promise you, you're gonna be proven wrong. But first, what's up? My name is Connor McDowell and I'm currently campaigning to be People Magazine's Sexiest Man Alive for the year 2024. If you like this video and you think I should be nominated, just click subscribe. One subscribe equals one vote to get me on the cover of People Magazine with the words Sexiest Man Alive right next to my giant head. And this is a lifelong goal of mine, so if you don't subscribe, I'm gonna consider it an act of hostility. I'm also currently recovering from three separate surgeries, so I have a GoFundMe linked in the description if you're willing and able to donate to that. I'm also going to be doing a 24-hour live Twitch stream very, very soon to help raise money for that GoFundMe, so keep an eye out for more information about that. I should have some more information about that next week. Also, please follow my Letterboxd. I've been watching a lot of movies this year, and I think it would be really cool if you followed it. And also follow my brand new Twitter that I made. You know, I feel like a dumbass because I really thought that movie trailers, at least this year, couldn't get worse than the fiasco that just happened with the Megalopolis trailer. If you don't know what I'm talking about, about two-ish weeks ago, Lionsgate released a trailer for Francis Ford Coppola's new movie, Megalopolis. But in this trailer, they used fake negative movie reviews from Francis Ford Coppola's other films that are very critically acclaimed, The Godfather, Apocalypse Now, and Bram Stoker's Dracula. But then it came out that these quotes were not only faked, but were generated using AI. Massive shocker there. So the trailer for Megalopolis is awful, but I really do think that this Minecraft trailer is even worse. But you've heard enough of me yapping, let's watch the trailer. Alright, we're eight seconds into this trailer and I already got something to say about it. If this screenshot feels weird or wrong to you, it's probably because the entire arch in the background is made out of dirt. Like, there's there's no other blocks mixed in there. This already doesn't look like something you would naturally see in Minecraft. And get this, it's the fucking Minecraft movie! But you know what? Maybe I'm just nitpicking. Maybe the trailer will get better. The only way we can know is if we continue watching. <laughs> Oh god, oh, immediately already. Well, two seconds later and we already have something else to complain about. What the fuck is this? What is this? Why does this look so bad? I'm honestly really confused about what the fuck is happening in this image. One, this tree is really, really short. This waterfall is real water. And then you have four of the main actors in whatever the fuck they're wearing, which we'll get back to, standing in front of a green screen. You can genuinely tell that they are standing in front of and on top of nothing but a green screen. This literally looks like a skit that I would see on the morning announcements in high school. Like, it, it looks terrible. Okay, I'm already confused about something else. Why is the portal blue. Minecraft portals are, aren't are blue. So what I think this is, is I think they're Jumanji-ing it, and the blue portal represents the portal from the real world and the video game world. What the hell? 
Yeah, this, this is awful. This is terrible. This straight up is not a Minecraft sheep. What the fuck is this creature? What is this thing? You literally just made it a cube and said it's Minecraft. Eat up, suckers. Who is buying this bullshit? This is insane. Okay, I do think this is kind of the opportune moment to talk about their outfits because they're all kind of positioned in a way where I can see them. First of all, these don't look like clothes that you would see in a Minecraft world. These don't even look like Minecraft skins. This kid is wearing a red hoodie and he's got a satchel. And then this girl is wearing like a green dress. Danielle Brooks is wearing this fucking absolutely awful jumpsuit. This is an Oscar award nominee here and you put her in whatever the fuck this is. To be fair, she's also in the Minecraft movie. So, and then Jason Momoa is over here looking straight out of the Barbie movie. I really wouldn't be surprised if they looked at the Barbie movie and said, oh, the costumes are really colorful and, and that's what people really, really liked about that movie. So let's just put a bunch of crazy costumes together and just pretend like they're Minecraft skins. Look, for all I know, these are genuine actual Minecraft skins that exist in the game. I don't know. I'm a casual player. But like, come the fuck on, man. There are so many more iconic outfits that you could have picked from. You chose to do this? I'm a little confused. They're in the overworld here, but the piglin and the ghasts are completely fine. Like the pigmen are not zombified at all. They've crafted flying vehicles with ghasts. I feel like the people that made this movie have never played a single game of Minecraft in their entire life. This does not look like Minecraft. I feel like that should be the biggest point of this video is that nothing in this goddamn movie Looks like it's from Minecraft, except for everything being vaguely cubed shaped, and I guess I'll give credit to the the leaves on the trees. They kind of look good. Okay, so this is the, the crafting situation that we've got here, right? He's putting some things on top of the crafting table and then says Kadoosh, and then it builds the thing. What even is this? Is this a thing in Minecraft? Is this a thing that exists? Am I being dumb? Like, could somebody please genuinely tell me what the fuck he just built in the comments? Anything you can dream about here, you can make. Why is the creeper fuzzy? Are creepers fucking fuzzy? Am I finding this out for the first time? Are creepers fuzzies? Oh, you're a fuzzy? And now we get to the part of the trailer that everybody's been waiting for. Who are you? I am Steve. So they got famous musician, comedian, and actor Jack Black to play Minecraft Steve. You know, this guy from Super Smash Bros. And they said, you know what would be funny? If we just made him a guy. Yeah, that's a great idea. I like that idea. That's fun. Look, I really don't want to shit on this idea because in a better movie, that could actually be a funny reveal. Maybe if it was done right. But come the fuck on. Jack Black and Jason Momoa are not going to be able to sell enough tickets to this dog shit. Okay. Oh, this guy is such a tool bag. <laughs> Okay, wait, I've changed my mind. I love freaky little CGI llamas that stand there and eat things while little freaky pigmen run past them. Two tickets, please. So yeah, that was the Minecraft movie trailer. And also the movie is called a Minecraft movie, which I don't like at all. That's a dumb name. You could have just called it Minecraft or the Minecraft movie but you had to call it a Minecraft movie. Look at me, I'm finding shit to be mad at. Now that you've watched the trailer, you may be thinking, okay, you know what? That trailer wasn't that bad. And you might be excited to watch it. I don't know who you are. You're probably three years old, but you might be excited to watch it. Well, the majority of the over 16 million people that have seen this don't agree with you because it's currently sitting at 793,000 dislikes, which is an absolutely absurd amount of dislikes on a movie trailer. This Madam Web trailer from nine months ago only has 245,000 dislikes, and this is considered by many people to be the worst movie of the year. But 793,000? 
1,000 dislikes versus the 492,000 likes, which I really don't believe that 500,000 people watched this trailer and thought, yeah, let me click the like button on that. So these likes are either all children or bots. You simply will not convince me otherwise. And the comments weren't much nicer either. I went through the seven stages of grief in one minute and 20 seconds. This feels like a nightmare. I can't believe I might have to apologize to Minecraft story mode. Hello, Borderlands? Yeah, you know that award we gave you for worst video game adaptation? Yeah, we might need that back. Unironically, I think watching the cast of the movie just play Minecraft would have been better than watching this movie. And honestly, I feel like this is a no-brainer comment, right? Especially after watching whatever the fuck that trailer was. I genuinely would rather watch Jason Momoa just actually play Minecraft. That'd be funny as fuck. I want to leave this video with a tweet that I saw that I thought was really funny. Tenacious D died for this. And if I'm being completely honest, if we look at the Tenacious D members right now, one of them said that Trump should have actually been shot, the other member got mad at that member, and then that person went on to star in the Minecraft movie, which if you ask me is a much bigger offense than saying fuck you to Donald Trump. Anyway, that's gonna be it for me today. If you like this video, don't forget to click like and subscribe if you think I should be nominated to be People Magazine's Sexiest Man Alive for the year 2024. You can follow my letterbox, my Twitter, my Instagram, and all of my other social medias. You can join my Discord, you can follow my Twitter, and if you want to, you can donate to my GoFundMe. The links for all of those are in the description down below. I'm Connor McDowell, and I'm gonna go play some actual Minecraft and forget that this monstrosity even exists in the first place. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time.